We, we know the basic premise is that we have this dark story and a murdered child opens the series. But what more is there to this that you think is really going to bring in the viewers? Um, I think that the, that the difference between this and any other murder mystery is like, number one, I like that it has closure. You know, um, I, I kind of get bummed out like when I watched like, you know, murder mysteries or something like that and then there's no closure. Or, you know, the person got away or something like that. Like, I mean, I think that's pretty cool. Um, I also think that it's it's just more than just one case. It's actually like uh, I think I think that you know the tagline says it pretty good. It's like small town big secrets, and uh, you know it, it's like not everything is what it seems at first. And uh, I I I also do like I, I, sh I we would show up you know when Jackie Weaver was doing a scene or Dignoti who's just amazing in this, and uh, you know Anna Gunn and you know David Tennant. And I'm like they're just fantastic. And, I, there's just like a lot of actors that I really admire in this, so it's a different style of acting, and it's and it's more like a film in a way. Um, so, I mean, that's that's pretty different. Well, and it's only ten episodes. Does that feel easier for you for this kind of story that you get this closure at the end? Yeah, I don't know if I could do a procedural <clears throat> at this point in my career. I think it'd be a, a bit difficult. I mean, for me to keep my attention on that stuff, you know. Um, but I do feel like. Uh, it, it's it's a it's great to have just ten episodes. Um, that way you can really dig into like the three act structure in a way, even though you don't quite know where it is. I'm like, um, but the writing is good from you know the first episode to the tenth episode, you know, and uh, uh, I think that's all I can tell you about it.